Hey everybody, what a great response we've had on this new series so far. Thank you all for the new subscriptions and anyone who shared my video. I'm super excited, so let's get started. Wait, 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 wait. Before we start, I would love it if you could like the video and subscribe to my channel. Now let's get started. Our first article comes from ZDNet, a business-focused technology news site. Now, they reported that hackers are now targeting gas pumps on the internet. Yeah, I, I know it's weird, but, but stay with me here. One method that they are using is by having criminals, which of course lie about their identity, sell modified smart meters to the gas stations. Smart meters are devices that check how much gas you used. The smart meter's firmware can be altered to increase or decrease the cost of the fuel. <laughs> Our next story is kind of dark. It's from Gizmodo, a design, technology, science, and science fiction website. They said that there's a reverse solar panel in the works. It's powered by darkness. It uses something called radiative cooling. Radiative cooling is our sun's energy being reflected off the earth. Although it has incredible potential at this time, they can only harness a tiny bit of energy, so you won't be getting this in your house anytime soon. Moving on, Vox, an American uh, uh, news and opinion website, explained that AI, or artificial intelligence, was able to solve a 12th grade standardized science test. The system, called Aristo, solved in the New York's Regents Science Exam with more than 80% accuracy. I hope that 12th graders aren't going to be like carrying a backpack and a PC in their backpacks and breaking their back and yeah, whatever. It's going to be pretty interesting what they end up doing though with this technology. Our fourth article today comes from IBT, a not very well-known American online news publication. They reported that there are dangerous SIM card flaws that we didn't know about until now. It's called SimJacker. It can completely use your smartphone to its full potential without you even knowing. It can install malware, place calls, play ringtones, and more. It can even find your location. And you wouldn't even like know what this is happening unless you watch my video, of course, then you would know. Finally, once again, we have a story from ZDNet. This one's pretty interesting. Over 47,000 Supermicro workstations and servers that use Supermicro motherboards are now vulnerable to a new set of vulnerabilities called USB Anywhere. That can, they can change the baseboard management controller, which is the device that monitors the CPU, firmware, and OS. This means that hackers can remotely connect to the PC and log in like, completely without any password. So that's... that's I mean, it's pretty scary, <laughs> like, right? <laughs> Super Micro PC. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you just liked this video, you can hit that button. But if you liked it, hit like, get subscribed, and hit that bell icon to be notified of any future videos. Bye.